Yeah, don't cover your eyes while you're walking up the st What is, what is, what is, what is going on? I know I said I was gonna test this pack out with one of my sims from my occult baby challenge series if you don't know about it I'll have a link in the description for you to check out but I decided to make a brand new sim just because I really just wanted to start fresh try something new and I thought it would be a good idea just to separate the occult baby challenge from this because if you guys do enjoy this video enough maybe I'll even make this into a series I would totally be down to do something like that do tell me down below if you want this to become a series but um yeah today we're gonna be trying out the new i think it's called dream decor makeover whatever it's called we're gonna be trying it out today and seeing if it's worth the money especially for someone like me who isn't necessarily a builder i'm gonna see if the pack is still fun for someone who just wants to get better at building but first let me introduce you to my sim this is courtney aranda and I think she is so cool. I definitely love her vibe. I think if she was real, we would be really good friends. I did use some of the new stuff and some in-game pieces and I've been sleeping on Maxis Match, like CC and in-game stuff. Some of this stuff is really, really nice. I need to start incorporating it more into my cast features. So yeah, this is Courtney. She is an up and coming interior designer and right now she just rents out an apartment in Samaishuno, but one day she does want to get a mortgage on a house, maybe even start a family or something. I don't know, we'll see. We're gonna make up her story as we go along and I'm really excited to play with her. Her traits are a perfectionist, ambitious and creative. She has the successful lineage aspiration and her likes and dislikes. What is all of this? Oh, I updated Wonderful Whims, which is a mod that adds attractiveness and a bunch of other features. I will have it linked in the description if you would like to go and check it out. But I guess they updated their software and gave us attractiveness in the likes and dislikes category, which is such a cool idea. Idea. I hope they do something like this in game eventually. I think that would be an amazing addition to the game. So yeah, there's a bunch of attractiveness categories here, but I'm not going to go through that now. I'm just going to show you what I gave her from the in game categories. So her favorite colors are blue and yellow. Her favorite music genre is easy listening music. Her favorite activities are photography and piano, but there's no piano in the apartment. So hopefully when we save up a bit of money, maybe we can get like a keyboard or something. And her favorite decor style is contemporary, mid-century and modern. Oh, and suburban contemporary. This is just the decor style that I like. And yeah, this is her. I hope you guys like her. I literally think she is absolutely gorgeous and i'm excited to see where this series potential series takes her if you do enjoy this video make sure you give it a like and subscribe if you're new comment something down below and let's get into the video okay quickly i'm gonna give you a little tour of her apartment that i quickly built off camera and no i didn't use any money cheats i just used the funds that she had and i'm not done with the apartment i definitely want to add some more stuff once we get some money but this is what i was able to do for now so this is like the entryway and this is her little living area um there's no tv i really wanted to put a tv here but we just didn't have the money for it so we'll have to wait till we can get that i am in love with these sofas they really give me ikea vibes and i actually used to work at a sofa store um called dfs in the uk and i feel like i have seen these exact sofas in store like i've had to give sales pitches to people for like sofas that look exactly like this so it's really cool to see it in game this is the kitchen i'm definitely not done with the kitchen but as you can see i added like her favorite colors into the decor so blue and yellow and i am in love with this stove top and i gave her this little like port i think it's a portable oven but yeah i am in love with this kitchen and i gave her a little like bar stool area where she can eat because there really isn't space for a dining table this is her little bathroom and it's actually kind of freaky because i have this exact sink in my bathroom i'm not even joking literally my sink looks identical to this so it's kind of like trippy seeing it in game but yeah her little bathroom got her shower over here and then let's go into her bedroom which i absolutely love i got her it's like a double bed two side tables got her a desk with a mirror on top i wish we could like 
put stuff in this part of the mirror but you can't which is kind of weird but whatever i do also want to get her like a pc or a laptop or something but we don't have the funds for that right now and this is her little wardrobe area which is so cute i put a little mirror here and yes i still get that little mirror glitch where there's like no ceiling or anything in the reflection but yeah this is her little like wardrobe area i'm in love with this plant it looks so pretty it's kind of yeah it's giving me alpha vibes a little bit like can you see like the feathers it's kind of like an illusion <laughs> i love these paintings they're so cool and minimalist and i gave her some pretty blue curtains i couldn't get them to snap up at the top which is kind of annoying but it is what it is and that is her cute little apartment which i'm in love with as we get more money we can decorate it a bit more and maybe save up for a actual house somewhere which could be pretty cool but for now she's just a girl living in the city i'm talking as if i've already decided to make this a series guys definitely tell me down in the comments if you want this to become a series because i kind of do <laughs> okay so first things first getting a job so let's join a career here we go interior decorator being an interior decorator is about two things having a good eye for design and building relationship with clients having people skills and some artistic vision will lead to a bright future and possible recognition you may start small but with some simple home renovations but eventually with enough hard work bigger clients and buildings could get you the recognition you deserve now hiring interior color consultant this is where we're going to be starting off median gig pay 600 simoleons so let's join the interior decorator career and we are now a interior decorator um we have an average reputation average performance let's get our first job there's only one job we can do and it's a room renovation we suddenly came into a few simoleons and thought what the hey let's change things up can you renovate a room for us just a change of pace give us a holla and we can tell you some things we like or don't like okay the pay is 540 simoleons which isn't much but we've got to start somewhere so we start on monday at 9 a.m um it's currently sunday 8 a.m so we have a whole day just to do nothing oh what's this impeccable taste beautiful a refined choice courtney loves mint century decor so she likes the way i decorated her apartment which makes me really happy because i did spend my time decorating this since the main focus of this video is supposed to be looking at the pack i'm just going to fast forward until we are actually at the gig so yeah i'll see you guys in a bit Oh, you can't be serious. There's always a freaking fire. <laughs> Guys, I was literally just getting her to make a grilled cheese sandwich and a fire broke out. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Oh, an a counter got burnt as well. Oh my gosh. <sighs> she almost died in the first like 20 seconds. Oh, we can't even afford to replace the stove. And she's scared, thinking about the fire. It's hard to stop thinking about what happened. Oh my gosh, I just wanted a grilled cheese. Okay, so it's the next day and I just got this little pop-up that says, it's time for Courtney to head to the client's lot. Getting there on time can be a good opportunity to get to know the client's likes and dislikes ready to head over. And I'm really happy you can send her alone. Just in case you don't feel like doing any building she can just go into work and you know get her bread but today we're gonna go to work with her which i'm so excited to do okay so we're out here in sulani and this is our client's house which is a really really nice house oh taking before and after pictures to document your work as an interior decorator is important learn how to take control and get that perfect shot in the taking photos lesson on the dream home decorator we don't need that right now okay she's just knocked on the door and these are our clients oh it's kind of bare in here there really isn't much furniture oh and she's doing stuff with like those color thingies <laughs> okay so let's get to know our clients 
let's do a friendly introduction oh we can straight up just ask about his favorite color so that's exactly what we're gonna do we can vent about recent fire i don't think he cares okay so he likes the color green i don't know why it doesn't show up here which is very interesting but okay so he likes the color green discuss decor trends let's maybe i think he also lives with his wife i don't know where she's at okay she's heading downstairs so we're gonna ask her about like her favorite decor style let's do a friendly introduction first okay let's straight up ask her favorite color and is there an option to ask about to ask about taste and decor yes but i don't understand why isn't it showing up here oh she likes the color black so green and black and she dislikes queen and decor okay that's good to know let's ask his favorite decor style too okay he likes boho decor which is very interesting okay i think i don't know why their likes and dislikes aren't showing up here i don't know if it's like a bug or something but i think i'm gonna send the clients away are you sure you want to send the client away you won't be able to discover any more of the client's likes or dislikes once they leave i am sure okay i'll head out now so you can get started see you later okay they haven't left i don't understand what's going on they are not leaving what is what what is going on okay guys the get to know option isn't like being ticked off even though we got to know about his likes and dislikes i definitely think it's because their preferences aren't showing up over here which is really annoying because we found out their favorite color we found out their favorite like decor style we sent them away but they are still here for some reason like it's really bugged <laughs> i'm not gonna lie the the pack is quite bugged uh, hey guys this is editing dice here so basically i just wanted to quickly address something you see how in the client section there is no know like question marks how it's supposed to be in the pack well i thought it was a bug with the game but it actually ended up being one of my mods and you won't believe what mod it was wonderful whims so i've taken it out of the game and i've checked it again the career works perfectly fine so those little attractiveness additions to cast they kind of messed with the career but if we do end up doing a part two of this video there won't be any bugs or anything like that it will be smooth sailing however i have heard that a lot of people are finding this game pack really buggy so that is quite concerning if any of you guys have bought the game pack please do tell me down in the comments below what are your thoughts on the pack are you finding it really buggy or experiencing Experiencing any sort of like glitches or something let me know and yeah I will give it back to present dice and enjoy the rest of the video but um I think I'm gonna get started with the decorating now I don't know what room I should do or maybe I should do one of these sad <laughs> bedrooms I think I'm gonna do this bedroom over here so let's go over here and take some before photos okay so we're gonna do it from this corner of the room this room's basically a box so it's pretty easy to get some before and after photos all right i think that's enough okay so in the corner here it shows our budget and it's supposed to show what the client likes and dislikes but nothing is showing up which is really 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 annoying but we do know that they like black and green and they don't like the queen and decor but they do like the boho style so we're gonna just filter everything by boho and let's see what we can do i don't know if this is supposed to be a kid's bedroom i'm guessing it's supposed to be a kid's bedroom maybe they're planning to have a baby and want to decorate a gender neutral room which could be quite cool um i might even get rid of these windows because they don't look very child friendly or toddler friendly so i'm just gonna get rid of these maybe get some big windows in this room can we change the flooring it says no new floor tiles allowed um but the flooring's not that bad anyway so i'm just gonna keep that oh look at this bunk bed this is sick oh my gosh this is so cool oh that is so pretty okay i think let's do it facing this way um let's get a different light in here as well maybe something like that and add 
Oh, yes. Okay, let me add some more black accents to this room. Okay, so I like this black rug. Um, let's add some stuff to the table. Just maybe like a little plant. Oh no, let's filter boho again. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, um, this is absolutely gorgeous we have to put this up like over the door maybe that's kind of cool and we definitely have to get this plant in here this is like one of my favorite plants oh and it fits so beautifully in the corner yes i'm keeping my eye on the budget while i do this because i really don't want to go over on my first job so uh, let me think oh a bookshelf would look real good in here okay so i am under budget which is good and i think i'm finished with the room actually let me get one of those diary things i think that would be a nice addition to the desk i also got a little fish bowl because i just thought it was cute okay i think i'm done with the build personally i think this room looks freaking amazing i'm going to now come in and take the after photos oh she can't get in because of these okay i'm gonna have to move these but i thought they looked so cool <laughs> above the door like that but i guess it makes sense she would probably like hit her head on them or maybe i can move it just above the door like that is that still going to interfere with the door let's find out shall we okay she can come in now so let's take some after photos okay i think it was this corner we took a photo from oh my gosh look how much better this room looks like wow i can't believe i did such a good job if i'm being honest if these clients don't like the way i did this room then i will be really upset because i think this room looks really good and i did try to stay in the color scheme that they liked and the sort of aesthetic that they like as well like look at this room and then look at this room Try. you see a difference because i definitely do okay can we do the reveal now what is this woman doing <laughs> okay let's call the clients to the lot even though they are already here okay let's assign the before and after photos i can't really remember which part of the oh no i can i can i can is she going to work get back here i have to show you your amazing new room what are you doing is she really going off to work right now why is the guy still in the house where is he i swear i just saw him do you want to personally show off the renovated space yes i do okay so we have like a little like events thing reveal renovations to client okay oh they're covering their eyes <laughs> they're covering their eyes oh my gosh okay that's kind of cute yeah don't cover your eyes while you're walking up the what is what is what is what is going on okay we've got a little slideshow thingy which is pretty cool no seriously look how dead that room is and look at it now i hope i like match them up properly like the photos i think they're still downstairs oh no they're coming up let's show off don't go and watch tv let's show off some of this new furniture i'm gonna make sure i show off the boho stuff because i know they like their boho she's really hung up on that fire that happened oh wait she just like shaked her head in disappointment well you don't like the bunk bed i'm literally just talking to them about anything i'm just waiting for the final verdict um i don't think the wife likes the room that much which is annoying because i think it looks really good all we've got to do now is ask client for final verdict um but they're still checking out the room oh he gave us a hug i think he likes it she really doesn't like the decor but he said he really liked boho so i gave them a boho themed room i think i've seen enough let's go over my thoughts okay 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 let's ask for final verdict i think he likes the room but i'm really not sure about her okay what do you think it's really dark in your hallway <gasps> he loves it and now they're like shaking hands it might not be what was asked for but i like it definitely appreciate the effort you asked for boho and i gave you boho i'm ready to wrap this up okay let's ask for her final verdict <gasps> i think she likes it as well and we're also doing the little handshake no way courtney has completed the gig and has received the following results i got zero money for that and my professional reputation dropped it might not be what was asked for but i like it what i literally did what you guys liked i did boho i did the green and black how did i earn no money 
you know what let's just go home okay so we are back at the apartment and i guess we didn't get any money for everything we just did courtney put some effort into decorating the space but the client didn't seem too impressed was it lack of vision artistry spatial awareness maybe another gig will help make things right i still can't believe we didn't get anything for all the effort we put into it well i think i'm gonna wrap this episode up here if you guys do want a little series with courtney let me know down in the comments make sure to give the video a like if you did enjoy and i will see you in another video